Hello, and welcome on back. It's been a bit. Decided I would finally start recording again, get back into it. It's been a while because life, but I'm going back into Rusty Lake Hotel. I'll be honest, I have no idea what I was doing. I know there were animals that I'm killing to turn into dinner, but beyond that, I don't remember what we were doing. So let's just hop back into it and see how well my puzzle memory is. I don't even remember if I have one or two guests left. I feel like it's two. Why am I still in here? Didn't I already kill her? Oh, I was trying to get the blackberries, wasn't I? Yeah, that tracks. Welcome to whatever day we're on. I don't remember. All right. Yes, let's cook. Don't ask where I got the pigeon from. I found it. The third dinner. The verdict. So I think the reason I had gone back and why it was still there was I hadn't fully finished it with getting all three ingredients. Because if I recall vaguely getting the blackberries one of those was like stupidly hard to figure out and i had to actually resort to cheating the night falls it's kind of nice being back in the world of recording for youtube who haven't i helped hey friend we'll go to one because i genuinely don't remember what floor anyone's on all right who we got um, okay, that's Mr. Deer. Is this Miss Pigeon? Now nah, we're gonna go to the boar's room. Let's go! I'll talk to him in a second, but I want to look around. Well, can't say that that was the best first thing I found, but you know. Okay, I hate these little monkey guys. No thanks, no thanks. Okay, so I'm gonna guess this and this maybe have to match. Doing good. Making some great progress of just where to shit. Dear Mr. Ambassador, I was informed by our mutual friend about your addictions and anxieties. I want to invite you to Rusty Lake. Our excellent mental health and fishing facilities will give you some rest. Yours sincerely, Mr. Owl. I don't trust this Mr. Owl guy. But it looks like he has the trees. That's locked, because that's what a key lock means, Berlin. Hopefully. <laughs> Can't say that I was anticipating opium to come out of that, but... Anyway. Bring me a sandwich. Alright, whatever. Yeah. And matches. I feel like I get matches in like every game. All right, so we got a blue circle and then the rest are red. Wait, did I say a blue circle and the rest are red? Smart Berlin, you're doing good. Yay. All right, I was figuring maybe I could, I don't know, mix those. All right, what are you guys? There's things I do remember. It's click actually everything. Because you never know what will be the thing you need. Couldn't tell you about the boar shit. Oh. Well, I made a sandwich. Aren't, aren't we... Aren't we proud of my sandwich? Here you go. Eat up. Finally. Enjoy. Oh yeah. I have to force you to eat. Wait, do you want another? Is that why there's lettuce that I still have? Oh. Take your axe now? No. Where'd you go? Oh, you're shitting, aren't you? Yep. Well, I'll just leave you be. There you go. lovely sound effects you got, Mr. Boar. 
Sounds like things are going great. It's a delicious sandwich. I think I could just make like infinite sandwiches. So there's clearly something I'm missing. But I can't get infinite toilet paper. Can I? No, oh, I guess I can. Okay, so I'm missing something. Well, I feel like I'm just going to be going back and forth if I just keep feeding him a shit sandwich. That's not quite what I want. You know, can I investigate the couch when he's up? Why haven't I done that? Oh. Still not 100% what I'm up to with that, but, you know. Can't take the thread. But at least now I have a candle. Here, do you want a candle? No. Alright, take the toilet paper. Okay. And you're just like two, three, two. Crazy monkeys. There's like nowhere to put in a code like that. I want your key. Let me in. Burn this place to the ground. Fine. You want another sandwich? No. Do you know how many sandwiches you've eaten? Do you know how bad they are for you? Oh, pipe. Is that all I had to do? Beep. There you go. Alright. Seems like everything's foggy now. Is that just me? Nope, everything's foggy now. Okay. I'm guessing the key's in here. Just like how smoky everything's getting. How you doing, bud? Doing good? <laughs> this is great recording. What the fuck? Where am I? I'm in a forest, and all I have with me are matches, a candle, and lettuce. Don't even have my toilet paper. Found your bird. Treating this like when I played... Is it Rusty like Paradise that I played a lot of? Where you had to click the bird a thousand times to figure out what it wanted. There you are. Let's go. Found you. What's up, bud? Thank you. You know what to do. I mean, I probably, but I'm still missing an ingredient. I have to stab you while you're eating. Like I said, click everything in these games. You never know what's going to be fucking secret. Oh, I need my special ingredient. Ugh. Well, I got tomatoes. You're proud of me. Cool. Don't mind this sandwich. Your toilet didn't have blood. Do I stab you while you're on the toilet? Now do I stab you? No. It's like, you know what to do. Boy gives me a knife and then it's just like, there you go. Brandish this knife at everything. Knife, 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 knife. Okay. Well, that might be useful. Knife, 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 knife. Give to me the battle axe. Look at this. They have to do with anything. I still have matches. So that's interesting. Let's see what I can do when he's not there. I feel like that goes further when he's not there. There you go. Eat your goddamn sandwich. Get out of my sight. Yeah, see, that shit goes low. I think that's the lowest it'll go. Give me the axe. Like, clearly there's something that has to go here. He can just stay in there. I'm not in any hurry. Like, what am I missing? What is your secret, monkeys? No, I wanted to stab you. Two? And now the rest of them. What the hell? Well, I broke that one, so let's... Alright, he's back where he belongs. That doesn't help me, guys. I guess I know why I have a candle. But, like, why do I still have it? And why do I still have matches? 
That's what I do. I make sandwiches. And I actually had a thought that that would work. Like I had to cut his couch open or something. <sighs> These damn monkeys. We were making progress. And then I got stuck with these damn monkeys. Now, if I recall, these aren't anything other than to let you know where the uh, hotel room key goes. And I think I can feed you sandwiches forever. I yell, let me in at a thing that is an axe. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Damn it. Five. Six. Six. Seven. Nope. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Oh, Jesus, that was loud. Yay. I never want to look at those monkeys again. Too dark. Okay, so blue all down one side. Okay, 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 okay. Yay! Is that how I get my axe? Or do I just hit him with it? Axe. Yes! Axe! Alright. Yay! <laughs> I feel like I've accomplished something that isn't just uh, helping a bore shit. Bam! Bam! Bam. Bam. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> okay, but how do I get the wine? No, I wanted the wine. No. Damn it. I have to play it over just to get the wine. I need all my stars. There you are. It's like, yeah, I know we have a meal to prepare. Yeah, I can't do anything about it. Gonna have to go back to his room and see if I can find his wine. Don't ask questions. You're gonna give me two stars because I didn't have wine. Almost perfect. <laughs> the guest goes to the room. No dinner at night. Then dinner at night? Whatever. I like to think I'm just spinning in a circle. Just like, all right, back to Mr. Boar's room. I need to figure out where the wine is. Wild boar in red wine with tomatoes, so I just like put some red wine out and then put tomatoes on a plate, and I was like, good enough. Oh, that doesn't do anything. Can I back out? So I did have to have go, go have a little peek, and it looks like the only way to get the final ingredient is to have already taken care of Miss Pheasant, which is a, clearly the one I don't, um, that one that's left. So, we're gonna finish this where I can't, obviously. Um, and then we're gonna go take care of Miss Pheasant, and I'll come back here. Yeah, you are the one I'm missing. Or not missing, but need to uh, deal with first. Otherwise I can't get the Oh no, if there's only one left. Mm, that should be interesting. Let's go up, my bat friend. Is she on floor two? Floor three? No idea. <laughs> I genuinely don't remember. I know she won't be those two, so she's either this one or upstairs. Yep. Please take my picture. Okay. That's easy enough. Don't mind me, ma'am. I'm just clicking. Lady in blue, Mr. Crow, Mr. Owl. I wonder if it's something to do with, like, coloring. Wait, did I just take the paper? Oh. Okay, yeah. There's something to do with that. Okay. I'm assuming it might be related to this. Or this has to do with the thing behind her. We'll figure that out. We got time. It's clearly going to be something. Time. Oh, okay, so see, we already have the white wine. Oh, it's Punch and Judy, I assume. Rusty Lake Theatre presents The Memories of the Lake, a dramatic story about the past and the future, featuring Miss Pheasant as the Lady in Blue, 
Miss Pheasant as Mr. Crow. Miss Pheasant as Mr. Owl. Seats may be booked to the box office. So there's her stamp. I'm missing keys. Got a plate. I like doing all this and I haven't even looked around. Was there a key in here that I... Yep. Clicked away and was like, hold on. I have to do something behind it. Do you go here? No. That'd be too easy. Magnifying glass. Nothing. Paintbrush. Okay. Okay. Got some symbols. So I assume this is how you clean it, but I don't have anything to paint with. Vivian Blue, Mr. Crow, Mr. Owl. Now I have a wet glass plate. So I can do different ones on different levels. Well, that's not really. So there's something I have to follow for music. Hat. Got a hat. I don't think you guys have anything for me. Unless I'm setting you on fire or giving you a hat. But now I have some wet glass. So, you know, the important thing. I love the music kind of stops as if it's like, man, you've taken forever. Like, give me a break. I'm still clicking. Here, do you want a hat? Here you go. You look lovely. Like, clearly I have this brush for something. Oh. Why'd you turn on? Was there a time on the invitation? No. <laughs> that would have been helpful. Do I have to paint things with her blood? So that would be weird. You're not ready yet. Okay. Do you want a magnifying glass? I don't know what it'll do, but I can give you a magnifying glass. I actually have an idea. Kind of. I have the semblance of an idea. Well. Well, found you. There we go. Got that one. So this is the lady in blue. I spent so long ignoring the <laughs> window in the last one. Okay, so this top one and all the way down. You ready yet? Yeah. That's cool. Did that kill you though? I hope not. Because I need you. <laughs> hey, did that show me anything? Okay. Circle. Triangle. S. Yeah. So that's for Mr. Crow. Here. Mr. Crow is the two ends all the way down. That last one's going to be interesting because I have a trackball mouse, so I just have to, like, hope I do okay. This one, because it is very much at the whim of my hands. All right. Good enough. Here. And there's already a picture. Well, that's fair. I actually didn't take it. Something is missing, but... I got my two light bulbs. Look at that. Oh, do I need to go get wet glass again? Punch, Judy, you got anything for me? You want this? No. There we go. Okay. Okay, okay. So I was kind of right. What up, Mr. Crow? Oh, um, 3.30. Doot, doot. Yay. I got a tiny ro Oh, for Punch and Judy. Here you go. Beat him up. Yeah. I'm gonna take this tiny axe. I'm gonna keep doing that anyway. All right, now what do I want with this tiny axe? What do I use? Eight tiny axe on. Not you. <laughs> just the tiniest axe. I don't think Mr. Owl would just have a axe. 
Oh, do I give you the tiny axe? Yep. I don't know why that took me forever. Small torch. Do you get that? <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's fair. Thanks, Punch. Thanks, Judy. Let's see what the light bulb says. Light bulb's happy. That's all I care about. Light bulb. Light bulb understood. What's up, Mr. Owl? That's how the music goes. Uh, I didn't take the picture. Why do I keep doing that? I don't need to entice that hand back. I already got him. We'll see. This is probably easier. Well, either way is easier. I guess it's my own fault for putting that picture on the other side of the world. So it looks like this is one entire end. So it was that and that. I know those two were different. Yeah, because that one has a gap. I did this one wrong anyway. Let's see. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Did that purely on accident. I meant to put that back here. Whatever. I'll take my accident. This does mean, folks, that this might be the last bit of this one. Which, if that's the case, I'm sorry it took me a hundred years to do this. Okay. I don't think I'm going to like this picture. You might. Oops. Do I need that picture? No. It's not going to give me any. Okay. Making sure. It's beautiful. <laughs> I don't know why I can look at the blood splatter. Well, there's no one here to eat. But now I have her key. Oh, we'll see. This could be interesting. I'm curious about the end of this game. I don't want to talk to you right now. I worked hard for this. Yeah. Got my cigars. It's all I care about. I guess. I don't remember. Does it taste good? Does the air taste good? I don't know who's eating this. You should bring the la uh, this last dinner to Mr. Owl. Okay. I have his cigars too. Maybe that'll save me. I don't even know who I am in all of this. Like, am I just some random extra person? Go and see Mr. Owl in his room. All right. But I want to dick around. I'm actually curious about something. Because obviously I know I have to, but I'm curious if I can actually go to Mr. Boar's. Yeah, let's replay. Let's replay. So I should have the wine. What's up, tomatoes? But I don't have the red wine. All right. That didn't work. It's just my own time I've wasted. God damn it. <laughs> Okay, so there's the wine. It's just not upstairs. Okay. So now I have everything. So I lied. You will see me do all of that again. Who this is for? Hmm. Maybe I'm taking this one to Mr. Owl. I will do just that, friend. For real this time. Yeah, let's go. There we are. The last dinner. Thank you for all the memories. You're welcome. And Harvey. Me. I'm really glad you brought the cigars. You're welcome. Lake I found it. Take a look at the black cubes, would you? Sorry, the lake's gonna be grateful for cigars. Black cubes. I'll get there. I remember all about the black cubes from the other one. <gasps> my friends! Oh, my shadow friend. Hey. My friends. All right, I looked memories up. are not only the key to the past, also to the future. Sorry, I interrupted him. <laughs> Have a look. It's in a book. Is this supposed to be like giving me a hint for Rusty Lake um, Paradise that I definitely already played? This is my friend. I remember Spooky Guy. He's less 
staticky this time. <gasps> me! I assume that's me. Oh, I can't click them now. Here I am, back at the hotel. To be continued? I wonder if that's Roots. Well, if that's Roots, then that's what I'm playing next, so... Anyway, uh, that's been Rusty Lake... God, I forgot. Anyway, that's been Rusty Lake Hotel, and... Uh, man, is this just a fun series of games to play. I'm always thrilled to play these. I know it's been a really long time, I'm very sorry, but I'm gonna get better at this, because I really like YouTube and I want to come back. But... This has been Rusty Lake Hotel. I will delve into Rusty Lake Roots next because I'm guessing that's going to be the to be continued from this one. Because it's not Paradise because that's a different place. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out together. Don't worry. But until then, I've been Cubus Horse. This has been the finale of Rusty Lake Hotel. And until I see you again, goodbye.